so that's how our balcony look like I am planning to get something a privacy screen that will wrap around it so I'm gonna price out how much it will cost for me to do that so I have to measure um, how many meters are around like that fence where it needs to be screened so I'm here in Amazon online that's their prices four to five dollar each there's 38 and that's for the pool actually the 38 dollar some are 52 dollar each so I need about 10 meters or 30 feet long so about two pieces or two orders of those screen so it cost me about a hundred dollars roughly plus tax IKEA Canada has um, balcony privacy screen too in white cost about 24 but checking on their measurement I may need about four orders so it would cost me the same thing plus taxes it would be like about a hundred dollars too so I have to look for a cheaper option so I went to the fabric store today and found this fabric it's five dollar per meter it's a wood design and I thought it's perfect because it's cheap and it's good for the outdoor weather and that's how it looked like it's nice there were other colors too but they were not on sale there are about twenty dollar per meter so I just go for the cheaper price to weave them I put um, some tacks to make it secure here it doesn't really fall at the bottom just to make sure see that I put few not in every um, line but just random to secure it so this morning I made um, something on a little extra fabric I have uh, it's a single panel here it's not much small one and I thought I'm gonna make a privacy screen for our baby gate we have a baby gate here for our balcony so that's what I'm gonna weave them through So here I'm doing some stitching using a needle because I want this secure here in the bar since I cannot really use thumbtacks because it's kind of it's like metal it's not the same as there it's wood so I'll use needle So I'm done stitching it. That's how it looked like. So I made a stitching all from here to bottom. I just use needle and thread here. That's how it looked like. So our balcony is now screened. You can see. 
Looks nice. I'll show you what it looked like outside. So this is how it looked like outside. The baby gate. Outside. So now you can see inside the balcony. And there you go. So if you can see the gap between the floor and the fabric, fabric screen, there's a gap. I did that on purpose because I need that little space when I sweep the floor. So I pretty much shove the dust under there or if I wash the floor. So that gap is useful for me. As I mentioned earlier about the pricing, um, if I have to buy it through Amazon or Ikea, it would cost me about $100. Um, they would give you the fabric and the sap strap and you would uh, do it yourself and like weave them through. But this project here, I do it myself. I've bought the fabric and I bought the thread and I did it myself. It cost me about $25 and some for, for like all of that. It could have cost me just about $25 if I have to do it like one side like you know what I mean one panel but uh, we decided to make it double so like that on the right side you can see like um, the fabric is um, um, doubled so if you go outside so here see they're double sided so I double them see instead of me cutting it here like that one panel I folded them in half so that looked like that so the fabric itself it was double the length of um, so if you can imagine that fabric there when I bought them is double the width so now it's just half because I have a half size because I folded them so that I could um, have make it like look like wood from inside and outside not like this so because I did that it cost me about fifty dollar it could have been fine just to do it like one panel like that but we thought it's nicer to look at it when it's thought it looked nicer when we can see both sides like wood that one is just one panel because that's my extra fabric so I saved half a price because I did it myself just bought the fabric and the materials for it instead of me buying it from Amazon for a book cost me a hundred dollars so it helps if you have your own sewing machine um, you just need that for your project pair of scissor and yeah, if you have extra time why not you make it yourself save money instead of buying it from the store and plus you can choose which fabric design would you like to make for your um, privacy screen so that's all for today thank you guys for watching and see you in my next video bye bye